right here again. And uh, this time I think I'm gonna do two because um, these are short. Uh, you have the solar system experiment. Uh, experiment experiment Brock Work has been cleared for uh, relic emits, uh, portrayal, uh, portrayal 60, of the solar system from the planets and the corrective relative scale uh, comments and relative orbital distance. Uh, you probably don't want to walk that far. This one is the human body scan. Seems to lead to an explorable third dimension mode to perform third dimensional bodies. Impossible. Okay, so these are the two. Experiment right child play with. Uh, has been that's safely the sign of red. It's best on top of the test lab. Nine to two. Good, good test says I have fully charged my portal sphere. I am the correct clock in the universe lab. The government doesn't know I exist. Uh, no one. C. I provoked a Velociraptor. Uh, I taught a primal, primitive creature how to smoke. Uh, I just gave birth to a Velociraptor. Uh, uh oh, looks like Brad just ruined the entire universe. Never read that before. That okay, so let's experiment or explore the solar system first. We'll see how this here goes. These two are pretty quick, so I just wanted to uh, get this over with. Uh, looks like everything's paused right now. No, it's moving, just really slowly. I feel like these moved around a lot faster at first, so maybe they've changed that. The ones around the sun are still moving pretty quick, but these ones not so much. This is Neptune, obviously in the outer sphere. I'm just gonna throw that over there, because fuck it. Here is Uranus, the second furthest away from the sun, now heading towards the sun. Uh, what do we got over here? This is Saturn, third furthest away from the sun, now going to be obliterated by the sun. We have Jupiter, fourth furthest away, then you get real close to the sun here. What do we got? Um, this is Mars. Get down here. I assume Earth is around here somewhere. Coming along, I'm sure. Yeah, there it is. Earth, going into the sun, because I hate our planet. Venus is second closest to the sun. And then you have Mercury, which is closest to the sun, and now furthest from the sun. So yeah, this is all it is. You basically look at all the planets in their orbital distance and throw them around. Uh, you can also put them back. There is nothing in the sun. It's just very bright in here. So, very hot, I'm sure. You can see, like, waves and stuff on the sun. Neat. Cool, huh? We're out of here. So that was literally just the solar system. That's all it is. Uh, you just check it out. It is pretty cool. Um, again, first time going in there. Really neat. Uh, second time going in there, not so much. You've seen it before. Pocket Universe Lab 8 has We'll do the an human experience. body scan along with this video so that we can get two out of the way. And since they're really short, I didn't want to make just a quick video on each one. Combine the two together, slap them together, make it good. Okay, so here you are in a dark room with a skeleton. Uh, you can't choose legs, you can't choose the arms, you can choose here, here here and there. So you have four access points of the human body. Let's go with brain first. So basically what this does is, there's your back button. Oops. Oh my god. Okay. So it just gives you a portrait of the top of the head and you grab this little thing here. It's like an x-ray. And you look inside. Oh, the inside of a human head. You can make it complete disappear, make it come back. You can cut the side. Look from the side there, so you can see like all the bone cavities and everything, and all the openings that a normal human being should have. And uh, that's pretty cool. Whatever. Same thing all the way around. So here you can see like the nasal cavities and the teeth. You can cut in and see like the neck and the spine and all that kind of junk. Uh, pretty neat. Here you have the chest area. So again, you can just cut into it with this 
see the entire spine, what it's supposed to look like. You can kind of see organs and stuff in here, very outlined, and then the skin, but not so much. Uh, you have your spine and everything, your ribcage, and then here's this lower parts of the body. You can still see everything in here. Um, lower intestines, pelvis area. Again, you just cut into it and you look at it. And that's it. That's pretty much this entire thing. I was joking around before and I was saying like, uh, you know, doctors will have this in their office by, what, 2020. And they're gonna put, yeah, somebody's gonna come in and be all like sick or injured. And they're gonna slap this VR headset on and open this up and say, okay, show me where it hurts. And then they're just gonna be watching the screen. So somebody's gonna cut in. Oh, uh, it hurts like right here. Um, uh, this second vertebrae here is kind of uh, sore, and this rib, and let me just cut in down here, um, it looks like right in here hurts, it's probably like a lung or something, you know, something stupid like that. <laughs> I can just see it, 2020 happening. So yeah, that is the human body. You just scan a human body, just to observe. It's pretty cool. Um, if you're into the human anatomy and the human body. Uh, they could have done a little bit more with that, but it is what it is. So that's done now, Test and you can throw the skull around. Universe Lab 8 has um, from an experiment. I think that is it for this video. Friendship just those two. Just been discovered in Pocket uh, Universe Lab don't 8. hang in there, ground yourself. To Pocket Universe Lab 8. So this video is done, and I'm going to end it there. Uh, next we're going to do this here portal related uh, robot repair um, thank you for watching I uh, appreciate it hit like on the video or dislike if you dislike the video hit subscribe to see more content from me and again hearts to you all thank you for watching <laughs>